What's up, fight fans? Main man, me man here. Y'all know how I get down. We talking boxing, man. What up to the fam? And what up to everyone in Main Man, Main Man's boxing form over there on Facebook? So check it out, fight fans. We are in for a bit of a treat coming up this coming February. February 26th, we got a major triple header coming down the pipeline. You know what I'm saying? With the uh, headlining fight being Chris Colbert going after his WBA Super Championship versus Roger Gutierrez. But most importantly, fight fans, is we're going to get Gary Antoine Russell returning back to the ring to take on Victor Postal, man. Yes, sir. This is going to be a good step up fight for Gary Antoine Russell. And this is a fight that I'm really much looking forward to. We know that Victor Postal is an old crafty veteran, been around the fight game for quite some time. Been in there with some of the biggest names in the fight game. Game, uh, names like Terrence Crawford, names like uh, Jose Ramirez, of course, names like Josh Taylor. And the biggest thing that comes from all of those elite names, fight fans, is none of those fighters were, un uh, were able to stop Victor Postal. They all beat Victor Postal in somewhat close fights. Victor Postal gained a lot of experience from those fights. And uh, he's a tough, crafty dude, you know what I mean? It's going to be interesting if Gary Antoine goes in there and make the statement that he wants to make. Now, we all know that Gary Antoine Russell, 14-0, 14 KOs. He's never been the distance in a fight. However, this will be his biggest step-up fight to date. So it would be real interesting to see if Gary Antoine is stopping opponents while stepping up in class. If that is the case, fight fans, well, that's usually the sign of a special fighter. He's coming off a big win in what was considered a step-up fight in his last fight against Giovanni Santiago, in which he got rid of Santiago easy work. So everyone is really dying to see Gary Antoine Russell return back to the ring. And uh, this is, should be somewhat of a treat right here, fight fans. Now, if he, like I said, if he goes in here and he does what he needs to do against Victor Postal, that's going to be big. Victor Postal brings a long, rangy style. He likes to move. He likes to use his jab. He's pretty much a master jabber. It's no secret that the jab is the favorite punch of Victor Postal. He throws a lot of jabs, and he definitely likes to fight at distance. His inside fighting is pretty much his weak point. And this is something that Gary Antoine Russell is taking note of. The good thing about these Russell's fight fans, something I've always expressed through the years, is that these are cerebral fighters where they study their opponent. They want to know the next move of their opponent. They want to know the style of their opponent. They want to know what happens when their opponent is put in certain situations and how they react and respond. These fighters are all in tune with those type of things. And you can listen to, to the answers that Gary Antoine Russell has got out here in the public about Victor Postal and the things that he is saying about him. And you can see that he's given nothing but cerebral answers. Now, the reason that people are, I guess, banging on the drum of will or will not Gary Antoine Russell stop Victor Postal because he's considered a knockout artist, at least at this point. And uh, of course, like I say, he ain't stepped up in class, but he's stopping everybody. And according to Gary Antoine Russell, he's going to finish Victor Postal in five. Gary Antoine Russell has a quote out here. He says, and I quote, I'm going to make sure that I am prepared mentally and ready to perform at a high level for this fight. These fights come down to who's more mentally stable. And that's a matter of training. I train my mental as much as I do physically. I've watched Postal fight before, and I know that he's rangy fighter with a European style. He likes to stay at distance, and that works best for him. He leans on his strengths, and every fight I come in planning to make a statement. My prediction, I'm ending this fight in round five, end quote. So Gary Antoine Russell is promising a five-round KO on Victor Postal, and I got to see if he's going to be able to execute that, and if he does... I'm telling you, fight fans, we're talking about possibly some sort of special here. And I'm dying to see how far Gary Antoine Russell goes. We know recently we just seen his brother, Gary Al, um, Allen Russell, uh, recently been defeated by Mark Maxeo, in which that was a fight in which he was injured in that fight. However, he made it all the way to the final bell. And there's a significant portion of boxing fans that believe that Gary Russell actually won that fight. And so Gary Antoine Russell is wants to come out and prove the Russell's name, the family name, and keep that on a high. He's going to want to come on out here and give a very good performance and let everyone know that the Russell family is here to stay all day. So I'm dying to see it, fight fans. We also know that there's a bit of a dust up between the Russells right now as well as Devin Haney. And for what is being told, Gary Antoine Russell possibly will be calling out Devin Haney maybe after the postal fight. 
We'll wait and see for that fight, fans, and I'm hoping so. And if that happens, we'll see if Haney want to answer the call, and hopefully with a clean contract this time around. But we'll see, fight fans. Victor Postal versus Gary Antoine Russell. You know, Gary Antoine Russell is a good inside fighter as well. If I had to guesstimate, I'd say that this is the point where he'll look to take the fight to Victor Postal, more so on the inside. Do a lot of damage there and see if Victor Postal can deal with the youth of Gary Antoine Russell. All in all, should be a good fight and going to be very entertaining to see Gary Antoine Russell stepping up in class all day. Thumbs up on the way out if he didn't hit it on the way in. Share, share, share. Rock them bells. Let's see if Gary Antoine Russell can do with no other fighter before him was able to do. And that stop.